Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome to a brand new series for Mr. Prepper. Uh, Mr. Prepper is, well, it's basically a survival building game where you need to escape the government, <laughs> basically. Uh, it's pretty freaking funny. This is the prologue. This is free right now on Steam, and uh, let's go ahead and start a new game, man. Well, I just played the game for about an hour, and I played through the entire tutorial. But just to stay on track and just so you guys know everything this game has to offer, Ever since we're going to play the tutorial again. The change of the government. This town has been unbearable. Lifeless. Filled only with boredom, propaganda, and control. I've tried to escape, and I've failed this time. Yep. But I'll find a way. They call me Mr. Mr. Prepper. Prepper. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guy's pretty freaking funny. All right, so here we are in uh, Americaville, USA. <laughs> so, I, I don't know. I, I don't think there's an Americaville outside of the USA, but who knows. And uh, we are back at your place of residence, resident citizen. For an attempted escape, we have confiscated your vehicle. This is standard procedure. Obviously, you are also prohibited from buying or registering a new one. Hmm. The agency expresses hope that you will not attempt to leave Americaville again. Oh, sure. Now I plan to fall back in love with this beautiful town. <laughs> I guess this agent doesn't understand sarcasm. Uh, this is a commendable attitude, citizen. From today onwards, you are also on probation. I will come for a brief inspection regularly to check for any subversive uh, actions or items. Hmm. This is standard procedure. All right, buddy. Hmm. You don't have to... You don't have to... I got it. I'm sure you will comply. Uh, and my visits will only be a formality. Bless the president. Mm. Bless. Yeah, I thought he was going to say bless the president, but now he said bless. He, he could barely get that one word out. All right, this is a tutorial. So let me show you around. Okay. So this is the standard boiler plate. WASD moves around. Um, you can left click to go places. I went to options uh, in the settings and I went to um, always run. Right? Now, can anyone tell me, will that make me get tired quicker or what? Uh, I'm not really sure if I should... You know, I'm going to take off Always Run. Basically, the game comes with Always Run off. If you want to run at that point, you have to double click or you'll walk. Mm -hmm. I'm assuming he'll use more nutrition and get tired quicker if he's running everywhere. But I I'm honestly, I'm not really sure. All right, so you can move around WASD and right mouse button. All right, move with Mr. Prepper. Left click and then run. Double left click. Come on. There we go. Okay. Pretty mm. pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, to see what you can do uh, on any object. Oh, you can right click on any object to see what you can do with it. Like, I'm going to look in this uh, cabinet right here. And I'm going to open. Mm. Uh, I guess I can't do it because it's a tutorial. But they just wanted to show you how to ah. do it. Uh, you are tired after your escape attempt. Uh, you deserve a nap. Okay, so we're going to right click here. We're going to take a nap. See, this is why... I like to keep him on always run because if I right click and have him take a nap, he'll run all the way here. If I don't, then I have to double click to get him to run here. Um, you are hungry? Go eat something. All right, so we're gonna run on down here. Honestly, I'm probably gonna be running everywhere anyway. Uh, and we're going to open this and we're gonna right click on this um, soup and we're gonna eat it. Beautiful. Uh, keep your preparedness high. This is your preparedness. This is this red thing right here that says preparedness. It's your most valuable stat. If it drops to zero, you will faint. Oh, Stay well fed and well rested to keep it high. Also, building and doing activities mm. keeps it high. So, um, Check your new escape plan. Okay, so th this up here is my escape plan. So we're going to take a look at this and see what this thing has to say. There we go. Mm. Goal number one, survive. Mm. Goal number two, escape. Goal number three, don't get caught. Uh, build the first room in my bunker. Okay, so they want me to build the bunker. Okay, I'm gonna turn this around. Hmm. Oh, really? You're not gonna let me do that ahead of time? Okay. Uh, basically, when the inspector comes, he'll see this and like kind of freak out. Uh, so you turn it around. I figure I could do it now, but I don't know. I guess not. All right, so we're gonna press B to open the build menu. We're gonna go right here. I don't think you can make hmm. it any other size. So we're gonna go ahead and build our first bunker. So now we have a bunker down there. I better check the backyard. Uh, you need to craft a ladder. Uh, this is the workbench. We need to uncover it. So we're going to grab the... All right, you know what? Until I hear otherwise, I'm keeping on always run. It's just faster. All right, so we're going to grab that. Okay. And then we're going to look at the workbench. Mm. 
It's not a good time for that. Workbench is a bit rusty. Let's see what you can do to refresh it. Mm. Disassemble. Mm. Okay, so you can craft, disassemble stuff, and if the agency sees it, they're going to freak out. So we're going to need some metal and some wood for this thing. So you need some metal and some wood. Uh, let's go by starting to buy some metal. So now... Oh, he's still not running, huh? Did I do that wrong? There. Apply. Maybe I didn't hit apply. There we go. All right. So right-click on this. Trade. Now there's going to be certain people you can trade with in the area. Uh, so it's time for some trading. Yes, do some trading. Mm. Make an op make an o middle I want to say make an offer. Make an order, collect in two hours. That's how it should work. Sounds good to me. Alright, we're gonna trade with this dude and we're gonna buy eight metal. There we go. I wonder how I make money. Does the government like give me money? Uh, this is your mutual trust level with this neighbor, so level two trust. And then it looks like there's some other people around here too. Nancy's house and the supermarket. Every time you level up your trust. You will get access to more and better offers. You may also unlock more traders this way via neighbor's recommendations. Oh, so I guess they recommended me to these people, and that kind of opened up a lot of stuff. All right, cool. Very good. Now we need to wait a couple in-game hours for that. All right, so we're going to go to the forest and find some wood while we wait. So let's uh, go to the forest. We're gonna just going to pick up some logs along the way. And I think we could pick some blueberries mm. while we're here as well. So we're going to grab that. I don't know if any of this stuff respawns. Like, will these logs respawn? Will the blueberries respawn? I have no idea. Again, this is just a prologue, though. Um, I don't know when the game's coming out. I was re I was doing some reading on the Steam forums, and I, some people are saying March. Don't quote me on that. That's just... Hmm. I don't know. I could have been, like, you know, misreading or whatever, but hopefully it'll come out in March. We'll see. The sooner the better, man. This game's been, like, um, in this early access, you know... Not early access, but in this, like, prologue demo situation for quite a while. And um, I've, been, I've been watching this game for a long time. Long freaking time. Okay, so we got all the wood we need, so let's go back home. All right, we just need to run to this... Uh, well, don't go there. We You can go in deeper into the woods, but I'm going to go home. Because that's what I was told to do. All right, so now we are on our way home. And then we are going to... Yeah, we have to di disassemble the logs. It's kind of like... Uh, it's the, the idea of disassembling logs, I guess, is like sawing them or whatever. I don't know. But disassembling one log is going to give me five wood, so we need to disassemble three. I did get an extra log because I'm going to want to eventually make a baseball bat. I don't really know if I need the baseball bat. I know there's a quest... Wait, what the hell? All right, there we go. I know there's a quest uh, where I have to, like, stop a wolf or something. I'm wondering if, if I have to, like, beat it to death with a baseball bat. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to find out. We are going to find out. Okay, I'm going to pick this up. Oh, wait, no, I can't. Yeah, that's right. I got to make the ladder before I can pick it up. Because what I want to do is I want to pick that up and I'm going to bring it down here. Okay, so there's my wonderful metal. So now we're going to come over here and we are going to um, upgrade the workbench. Yeah, we need to upgrade it before we can craft anything. That's what we need the wood and the metal for. <laughs> Look at all the lights in the distance. That's a, that's a nice little touch in other people's houses. I like that. All right, we're going to go ahead and craft the ladder. I know it's a little dark. I can't really do anything about that, but it shouldn't be dark for very long. My guy is getting quite sleepy as well. And hungry, but more sleepy. Alright. So we're going to put that right... Um, drag it. There we go. Okay. And now we can go down there, and I think the game's going to tell me to go to sleep. Oh, we want to make lamps. Okay. Alright, so in order to make lamps, you're going to need to disassemble glass, and the idea... Like, I thought, would be to just grab all the sil all this um, glassware or whatever. And just, you know, I'm going to take the cups from over here. Mm. And just grab all I need, you know, and just do what I got to do, right? I can, I can turn that into glass. But here's the thing. If the inspector comes and you don't have, like, a certain amount of things, like, he'll get suspicious. Like, if you have, like, no, no silverware, no glass or something, he'll get suspicious. I'm not sure 100% how it works, but I know... That you just can't take everything and destroy it. Wall lamp. Craft. Oh, you can learn new recipes by disassembling. Interesting. you always be able to reconstruct it. Uh, no more darkness. It's actually kind of cozy. Yeah, alright. Alright, so we're going to come over here. No, actually, can I pick that up yet? Grab. Yeah, I can't do it yet. Okay. So what we're going to do now is we're going to come down here and we're going to put a light. 
And I guess I'll just put it right there for now. All right, now it's time for bed. And it still won't let me pick this up, will it? Nope. Wow, so they're really... Because like, as soon as I wake up in the morning, this jackass is going to be at my door. You know what I mean? Can I even turn this? Hmm. No. Yeah, they're not going to let me do it till the morning. Right, I wish I could have done it before then. So when you sleep, I see these little glasses right here. Man, that means the instructor's coming today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wake up, and the second I get up, I'm just going to save the game. Just save the... Uh, not save the game. I'm going to pause the game. Come on, wake up. Wait, uh, wake up, bro. All right, oh. clock, pause. Okay. Now the first thing we're going to do is we're going to turn this. And then pause it again. And then we're going to grab this. Come on, run. I'm surprised he's not here yet. He should be here any second. And then we're going to pause. And these, um, these containers here also... Will cause some suspicion. Oh. Yep, there we go. He's arrived. Wait, grab it. Ah. It's not a good time. Really? Oh, wow. That's that's kind of weird that they won't let me grab that. I guess I have to take, like, some kind of hit for that stuff. Yeah, those barrels, like... I, I don't... Uh, let's try one more time. Hmm. No, okay. So we're going to do now is we're going to come up here. And we're going to cover this. There we go. And then we're going to answer the door. I knew what I was doing, and I, I almost, like, took too long. <laughs> yeah, I guess you have to... Yeah, you, you have to take the hit for the barrels. I guess it's just teaching you the game. So what he's doing is he's looking around, and he's looking for suspicious activity. Um, I should have took water out of my sink. I'm going to need water for crops, and, and it refills, like, over time, so I should have grabbed some by now. Can I eat while he's doing this? No. I can't do anything. All right, well, then I'm just going to uh, fast forward. He says some stuff as he goes through, but it's just like, eh, I'm looking around. God bless the president, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so, yep, two barrels. I mean, I don't think there's anything I could have done to get those barrels up. So, I guess I will, uh, I'm not going to worry about it now. He won't come for, like, another five days. Hmm. I need a time for breakfast. No, you didn't. Well, I knew about breakfast, but you would let me do it. All right, so I got to cook now. So, we're going to go to the refrigerator. Hmm. And I'm going to take out some carrots. Hmm. Wait, hmm. I can't open the refri the, fr the refrigerator? Hmm. That's weird. Okay, I guess I have to look in here first. Hmm. Yep, raw ingredients together. Apply some heat <laughs> and food. Cooking makes your food richer. Very good. I know I'm going to need water. Uh, remember that you can get most of your food... Uh, most of your food if you cook it first. Yeah. Uh, try to start with super smoothie. Soups additionally require water. Yep, got it. Got the water. You know what? I made soup last time. I think I'm going to try and make a smoothie now because I actually picked up the blueberries. So yeah, let's make, a, let's make a smoothie. I don't know how you cook a smoothie, but, you know, fair enough. And eat. I wish we would tell you how much it gives back. I mean, I could tell by eating it, but mm, that didn't give a lot. Alright, fair enough. Alright, check my journal. I should start checking my ultimate plan. That ultimate plan thing is hilarious, by the way. Uh, I kind of want to move this downstairs. Uh, I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, I'm going to move that down here. I hate having to go up in my bedroom to check the ultimate plan. So you could pick that up, and then you could move it. So I guess I'll put it right here for now. Yeah, it's fine. Do it. Nope. Wait, what? Get down there. Oh, <laughs> he can't go down there because it's still covered up. Okay, fair enough. My bad. I was like, why can't he go down there? All right, there's your ultimate plan, my friend. And then we need to check in and see what's next. What's next on the old agenda? All right, yeah, we need to establish a food source. Okay. Hmm. So the first thing we're going to need, uh, I need a food source to kick off my underground plantation. <laughs> the agent will not be happy to see that. Uh, to make a basic underground farm, you will need soil and seeds. You can craft soil from dirt in the workbench. I need seeds. I have some in my home. All right. So the uh, first thing I want to do is make an area, like my next area. So uh, I don't really like making it like right here. Maybe we could do it over here or up here. All right, I don't think I should really worry about it. All right. Let's make. um. Yeah, let's do it this way. There we go. 
All right, we'll make the uh, the food like plots over here, and then we'll use this to get to the rest of the base. I don't know. I don't know how far I could build, but you know, we'll see. Got something in the old mailbox. So let's see what that's all about. Uh, read. Okay. Dear neighbor, do you like flowers, herbs, and plants in general? Are you having trouble making friends in town? Are you tired of urban life and sad men in suits visiting your home? Do you enjoy nature? Well, yeah, sounds good. If any of this is true to you, and I'm sure it is, please come to the forest during the day. You might meet someone friendly. Okay, uh, we'll probably hit that up tomorrow. Uh, but first things first, we got to get some metal. Now, um, like I said, if you take too much stuff out of your out of your place, right... Uh, the dude will get suspicious. So I'm going to take three of these and hope that he doesn't notice. Because I need metal. I can always buy it. Maybe I should. I'm going to take three and see if he gets suspicious. Because I took three in my uh, in my test game and he didn't say anything. So maybe I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly how, how any of that works. But uh, right. So we need to... What do we need the metal for? Oh, yeah, the ladder. Oh, that's right. I got to take apart the metal. So right there. We'll disassemble these. And then I will disassemble this. And I'm also going to disassemble this purple cup. So I'm going to use glass to make some more... Uh, I'm going to need glass to make uh, more lights. I think I could have five lights with the electrical grid the way it is. So that means we need another... How much glass do we have? We have one glass. So that means one. So three more. We need three more glass. All right. I'll take care of that in a moment. Let's get the ladder done. Oh, we need wood. Okay. I do have some wood on me. I'm not sure. I only get five from it, though. Now, there's other things I could disassemble for wood, but I might just get wood tomorrow in the forest. I think that'll be pretty cool. Does does the inspector go inside these uh. these cabinets? I'll bet you they do. I'll bet you they do, because I'm trying to figure out where I want to dump stuff off. Oh, you know what? I'm not even that heavy. I've got a total weight there. No, I'm not even that heavy. I think I'm okay. Yeah, we'll go to the woods tomorrow. Let's uh, break up some more glass. All right, so we're gonna, uh, what I say, three? One, two, and three. All right, so let's come up here and break up some more glass and we'll sleep through the night. All right, the dude's gonna come on the fifth. By the way, in my test game, it was the fifth as well. So I, I don't know if that's random or not. Probably, it doesn't seem like it is. But here we are in the wee hours of the morning and I think we're gonna go out to the forest today and try and find the herbalist. Uh, and I'm gonna need some wood anyway, so that, that'll work out. Before we go out there, though, let's go ahead and grab some food. Come on, you slowpoke, hurry up. Yeah, let's go ahead and grab some food. Here we go, eat. What is that? What is that? <gasps> oh, shoot. What did I keep in my inventory that went spoiled? Probably... Actually, I don't know. Berries. It was berries. Okay, so guys, food can spoil. Does it say it can spoil? Or it doesn't say anything about it spoiling. So it can spoil. Keep it in the fridge. Oh boy, that's interesting. Alright, well I'll keep the spoiled food in there as well. Um, not a proper container. Oh, okay. Can I put it in here? By the way, there's my seeds. There we go. Alright, cool. Let's head out to the... Uh, let's head, to the, head out to the old forest so you can find the herbalist. So apparently the blueberries do respawn because, like, there's blueberry bushes, like, everywhere I'm looking. So that's pretty cool. I just gotta make sure to use them, uh, before the end of the day. So let's go ahead and grab those. Hurry up. He's like, come on, man, get off my back! It's a freaking lot of running here. How do I know when he's got them? He just got them, okay. Now you're gonna grab these, and then you're gonna go into the woods. We gotta go deeper into the woods. To find, uh, to find the herbalist. Come on. Get the lead out. Alright, right click here and use. And that will make you walk along the pathway. I remember playing the uh, demo and like the pathway wasn't available. It was just sitting there teasing me and I couldn't do anything with it. Do you get one? or No, you get two per harvest. Okay. Alright, now we have to go deeper into the woods, but I need wood as well. So we're going to go ahead and grab some wood. Oh, is that it? Can I go more left? Uh, yes I can. Let's grab some more wood. What is that? Hold on, I want to take a look at that. Oh, what is that? I haven't seen any of this stuff yet. Read. Hunter's Club. Everything what everything what the wilderness around Merrickville has to offer. Fresh game from different animals, free range, and 
and ethically shot to death. <laughs> and if you want to do hunting yourself, I offer a wide variety of traps and baits. Interesting. Okay. What is this Ooh. thing? Yeah, you do need to check out her stuff. Oh, cool. So that unlocked on the map. All right, that's cool. Let's take a look at this thing, too. Oh, here we go. We got some uh, feathers. Field ration. And, oh, glass. Damn it. <laughs> I, I didn't have to make any of that glass. Well, at least two pieces of it. All right, so I think that goes out to the outside. I'm not going to pick those berries because I'm starting to lose a little time here. I want to get, I want to stay as focused as possible. So let's go down this path. All right, we're at forest level three, Le level one dash three. What is this? Is that the same thing I read before? Yeah, the hunter's club. Okay. So I didn't have to read it there. I wonder if I could hunt those deer. Probably. All right, let's grab those. And then I think I got to go more left. Yeah, here we go. Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's grab that switch. Or that lever. And then we'll talk to the lady in the back. Hey, you! You're not as slick as you think you are. Oh, fudge. I wasn't hiding, just picking some berries. Bob, are you okay? Uh, is Bob the plant? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Hello, buttercup. I knew you would come. That's awkward. Uh, you seem like a strong and capable young lad. It's been a while since anyone's called me young. And you are? Hello. Oh, my manners. My name is Jenny. I'm the one who sent you the letter. Hello. Sorry for the secrecy, but one cannot be too cautious these days. Hello. You can usually meet me here around this Hello. time. I'm I'm a herbalist. That sounds weird. I feel like it should be I I'm an herbalist, because usually like A like if the word after the A starts with a vowel, it's an, and if it starts with a uh, Damn, I, I forget the opposite of the word vowel, vowel. A regular letter. Um, it's A. But herbalist sounds like it starts with an E, but it starts with an H. So that's that's correct. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. That's just... I remember sporadic things from school. Anyway. I'm a, I'm a herbalist. You're... It sounds so weird. Uh, your, con, your contact regarding all plant matters, you could say. Ah. Got it. People call me Prepper. Nice to meet you, ma'am. That's Mr. Prepper to you. Oh, just Jenny, please. And let me get to the point. I could use your help. See, I have this cozy cabin in the woods, but I can't get there now. There's a really vicious wolf hanging around constantly. I've tried everything. It didn't fall for my package of poisonous herbs inside a delicious sausage. Could you get rid of it for me? Hmm. A wolf in a cabin in the woods. Is a red hood and a basket required for this mission? Uh, you'd look lovely in bright red, but I'm no fat. I'm not... But I'm not fashion police. But I'm not fashion police. Uh, just help me so I won't have to explain big ears and teeth to anyone. In return, you can take anything you want. The materials left in my cabin. Uh, I need to do some resupply soon anyway. And once I have my cabin back, we could trade for each other. Do we have a deal? I think that sounds like a good idea. Mm. I'll deal with the wolf. You hear that, Bob? We'll have our cabin back. So I'm back home, and I think I'm going to continue making the farm, and I think first thing next video, we're going to go and do that wolf quest. Uh, we, we have to make a bat, and we have to go out there and find the wolves. It, you know, it's not going to be too bad, but I really want to get this farm going, uh, because honestly, this is the first thing they told me to do, and I probably should have had the farm up by now. <laughs> I just wanted to go talk to the old lady, so let's go ahead and make a ladder. All right, craft... Uh, oh, I've got too much weight on me, huh? Okay. All right, well, let's go ahead and put down the barrels. Because I'm sure that's adding to my weight. All right. Oops, there we go. Can't put down the third one because of the sign. Oh, look at that. You could stack them. Can I still get by it? Oh, I can. Oh, that's cool. I'll, I'll mess around with this and tidy it up a little bit later. But for now, that should work. Now we're a lot lighter. There we go. Now, where am I going to want to put this ladder? Well, I know exactly where I'm going to want to put it. I'm going to put it right here. Right under the other ladder. There we go. Alright, now we got to come down here. And let's put down some lights. Uh, I'm just going to put them kind of willy-nilly for now. And then, once I put the, the um... Oops. The uh, actual plots, the, like, you know, the farm, the farm plots need light. So, I'm going to kind of, like, mess around with them after I put down the farm stuff. But yeah, if you look up here, there's the electricity and we're at max. If we put down one more light, we will lose power. 
So that's not going to work. All right, the next thing we want to do is come up here, and we're going to go ahead and make five soil patches. One, two, three, four, five. All right, then we're going to come down here and put down the soil patches right up against the wall. One. Damn it. One. Two. And then I'm going to have to take a nap. Actually, I'll probably just wait and then just go to bed. Four. Five. There we go. And now we need to plant seeds. So we need to come up here and grab the seeds. I will also grab some water while I'm up here. I'm going to need to water the crops. Maybe I should go to sleep. Oh, uh, wait. That's not the right thing. There we go. Open that. And seeds. And there should be more up here. Yeah, there we go. Alright, there's all the seeds we got. And, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and take a nap. Okay, my favorite seeds are carrot seeds. Oh, that's not how you do it. I keep wanting to drag them down here. That's not how you do it. You right click, and then... Actually, I guess you can just left click. And then you go to plant. And then you click. And go to plant. Maybe I could shift click it in there. Yep, shift click and go to plant. Uh, we'll also do whatever this is. And... One of these as well. There we go. Alright, so the lights aren't looking too good right there. Uh, but that's okay. I'll kind of mess around with those. Yeah, you need to tank. Keep your farm well lit. More light gives faster growth. Okay. Um, yeah, so let's go ahead and... Uh, I'm going to water these first. And then I'm going to move the lights around. So... Alright. Nope. Yeah, that's not how you do it. There we go. You know what? I'm going to need more water too. Oh, I just clicked on it. Oh, okay, cool. Much easier. All right, guys, this is what we're looking at down here. Got everything planted. The little yellow, the little yellow bar on top is the growth, like speed. Uh, the white, the white, the blue bar underneath obviously is water. And uh, I did the best I could with four lights. I want this light up here so I could see. Uh, the electricity is a real problem. I don't know when that's gonna, you know, when I could do something about that. But yeah, this is about the best I could do with these four lights. So that is freaking cool. All right, guys, I am going to call this one here. Uh, I just wanted to say that I know about half of you watching these videos are not subscribed to me. And, um, you know, I, I respect that. You know, people don't want to always subscribe to everybody. But I just want to let you know how important it is for a YouTuber. I'm going to cook while I talk. Um, for a YouTuber to have the viewership be subscribed as well. Uh, YouTube loves it. If you, if you know, if you care about this channel and you want to see me succeed, you know, consider subscribing. I hope, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope today is the day I earned your subscription. And if not, I'll get you next time. <laughs> All right, guys. Anyway, um, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.